Hi everyone, I hope you are. This is Coins Kid. I'm just going to dive into XRP once again. Thank you for support. Okay, big up the Coins Kid crew. Thank you to each and every single one of you for everything that you do. Honestly, showing is caring. I really appreciate the level of support on the channel. Thank you for liking the video and your subscription on YouTube. Okay, so XRP uh, is at a whopping correction here. You've got this double M top pattern as well. You've got this, you know, the horizontal just there that you come up into. Beautiful continuation, break resistance, see you later, lose support. You're going to have a technical target to the downside. And you can see that that particular technical target was met of that double M top pattern as well from there to there. Let me draw this in. From there today, you can see you lost support and you carry out a technical target. Boom! So target mate has carried it out. Beautiful, you know. Target mate, you want to see that the pattern's in play is valid until invalidated away. We've lost support and you've gone short basically. So right now, you've you've bounced off that key level support as well, and you you retain in this structure of this horizontal which you're now in. Okay, so this is good. If you can continue to hold this, fantastic. Come back up the stairs, tackle that level of resistance. It's going to see a breakout to the upside, taking out that high. And you're going to be an impulsive break up here for XRP. You know, so it's all about holding this. Structure at the moment if you lose this structure then obviously you're rolling and you're going to go deeper potentially coming down to the 382 get a bounce but with that you can see you are losing structure you've lost this low okay so there is hope here for xrp as i'm trying to say to you but i do say hope's a dangerous thing but what we need to see okay on the weekly time frame for progression is a close above this red line so this red line currently sits at what is that that's 08411 and that's a weekly 20 ema okay we need to get back above that get back above that red line start to hold and close and get back above that green line which is 0618 is 91 cents then i would imagine you couldn't come up to the 20 if you start to get back above that and hold that over a dollar wow you know you, you're holding support and you're going to tackle that resistance once more and at that point this is where you could get the break to the upside for xrp okay you know start to come up and break out and that's it you take out that high you're looking at impulsive break i think to four dollars fifty isn't it minimal in this bull run for xrp so it's looking good you're holding a kilo of support and like i said to you the daily rsi was in the floor just there we are looking for a v-shaped recovery or some kind of w bottom pattern here like i said we're very overextended from the amaze at the moment i would imagine you are putting in a bit of a w bottom pattern on the four hour well, let's take a look at this uh yeah we did speak about this yesterday didn't we um you've got that kilo resistance just there get back up for 20 hold and come back up there is a kilo resistance just there for xrp you can see that it's running into right now okay Yesterday I did say to you, you've got some kind of broadening, bottoming pattern here. You do usually see the break. Once you break, you come up to retest where you formed it. And right now you can see that's what you're doing. And, and you know, you have got a beautiful little high-low just there as well. And a beautiful double bottom pattern that's forming. You know, resistance, sorry, support, resistance like that. You coil up like this. As soon as you break that resistance, you're going to be in a technical target to the upside. And you've got a beautiful little double bottom pattern there. And reversal with a massive support wick just there for big... Um, xrp so right here from there to there would be a technical break target once you break that level of resistance for xrp i'm going to give you that okay so it's all about support and resistance at the moment so at the moment xrp is running into this resistance just there if you do start to see it break that and retain and hold it because you can see on the four hourly time frame here you've got 13 minutes to go you are running into the resistance here this 20 ema okay so that's a key level of resistance as well so if you was to see this not close under it potentially you could come back down here hold that come back up and break that resistance eventually which put you in a technical target to that do you understand that that would be a technical break target from there to there 95 cents and it'll be a fantastic long opportunity when you break that resistance of around about 11.75 percent but with that you can see that what you're doing is you're getting back above the daily daily okay you well, you're attacking the daily uh, 20 EMA which is what you want to see but you would be getting back above this weekly 55 so you're making progression just there you know and you're running into the weekly 20 now it's all about getting back above this weekly 20 here because you can see how high up you are if you start to come back up against the 20 and this holds the support potentially creates some kind of horizontal or you know symmetrical triangle type pattern or even a bull flag at some point come back up once you break this resistance wow it's good it's good it's really good because you'll be take, breaking out of a huge horizontal horizontal okay that you're forming this is a kilo resistance like i said to you get the weekly close above this level resistance 
that my friend is a massive massive signal and if you're sitting on the sidelines waiting you know to enter xrp that could be the signal once you start to break above and close above this resistance boom you know you're going to be in a technical target to the upside of four dollars fifty in my opinion absolute minimal in this bull run for for xrp right there so you know you are making progression we do need to see these reversal patterns come into play and the more you zoom in the more you can see them so we've got 13 11 minutes to get a close above this yellow line on the four hour because like i said to you on any time frame when you get back above that yellow line start to hold it as support you start to come back up this is the progression you need to see you're creating a beautiful little double bottom pattern here with high lows okay break that kilo resistance at 84 7 and you're looking at a technical target at 95 cents 11 percent trade up right there for xrp okay transparency if you roll here and lose this support just here of this you know ascending level of support that you're creating for yourself for xrp then you could actually i'm not seeing any kind of bear pennant here you know you do usually see some kind of bear flag or bear pennant we're not seeing that at the moment but this is a key level support right there if you was to lose that then I would imagine, you know, you take out that low right there and you're looking to come lower and potentially retest this trend line once more. You lose that, it's game over, isn't it, for XLP? That's basically XLP. Hope you enjoyed that quick little update. You know, dive in a little bit more for you today. Take care, everyone. Back soon with an update on XLP. Stay healthy, stay strong, stay tuned. Bye-bye.